This is what I came up with. I don't know why I'm saying manamana. That's not what we're going to do. Doing it with my mouth, it enables me to get that projection from my brain out into the world without interfering too much with the other aspects of playing. At this point, what's in my head is not, it's not super modern sounding. It's got to sound garagey, you know, like trashy, just fucking trash. It's a cover of Manamana. I know it, I don't know what, it's, it's not a cover of Manamana. It doesn't really sound good to eat chia pudding on um, streams. Is that a little less audible? These are just rough sort of guides for now. Now let's uh, do something that I'm half good at, which is the drums. This is going to take me a few run-throughs because I, I haven't fully got the parts in my head, so... It definitely sounds like trash. Do you guys hear any of that? I'm sure there's a more efficient way of playing drums. I'm yet to learn, hence why I probably go through so much energy. <laughs> Guitars. Do I want to do it with an amp? And hear that noise? That's because I'm playing through a real amp. You can't play this shit with one guitar. You definitely need about four. Uh, I don't know what just happened then. Man, that slide is... Oh, I love slide. Screen share. Oh! I, I did that on purpose. <laughs> Xavier having a freak out. Show me how you eat eggs for mummy. How about you show me how I eat my toast? Eggs first and then toast. Remember my mum saying to me when I was little, You're not the boss. I'm the boss. I find myself saying it to, to Xavier. Did any of you guys actually get your, your mouth washed out with soap? No, but I got taken to the forest to pick out the stick. I want to get smacked with. Oh, wow. We've oversteered. I got, a, I got a clobbering just like everybody else. Around the time when I probably needed the most discipline and were having the most arguments was the time that I was on TV the most. And I remember just before I went on Conan O'Brien, we had a fight about something. I'm just about to go and have an interview and I just, this bright idea popped into my head because I had so much rage. I said, you know what I'm going to do? When I get in front of Conan, um, in front of the whole world, I'm gonna tell people that you abused me. And he goes, you do that and you fucking see what happens. <laughs> You'll get the biggest hiding ever. <laughs> Final listen, guys. Well, that was fun.